So as you can see, we are right now in the property environment and we have this red message right here, which says it requires input in order to be complete and continue. So the first things we need to do is to add the component list. So let's go to our presentation right here and check out what do we need. So physical properties, there are two things we need to fill. The components, which are methane, ethane, propane, butane, cycloxane, benzene, toluene, and the air components. So let's do that. Let's go to our simulation and add them. <coughs> we can either add the molecule and we'll find it. We can state the name, which I think is the easiest one. Thing, propane, thing. Or we can, if we don't know the formula or name, we can directly search it out here as CP same and wait for it to load many times it's one of the top three searches but let's wait for it to find it and it's right here just verify that the alias is actually the formula so we know the cyclic same has six carbons and 12 hydrogens so let's double click that and it has been added now we need to loan benzene And we need to add the air components, which is mainly oxygen and nitrogen. So this is how we fill the component list. It's so easy. Don't worry if you miss any component. For instance, you just focus on the hydrocarbons and then you are working in the simulation. And you remember that you need to add a, let's say, a airstream. You just go here, add your oxygen and nitrogen into the components. And that will be everything. You won't have any problem adding further components. So see you in the next video in which we will be working on the method.